look at this question guys this question says that k is equal to x4 plus 1 by x4 plus 1 upon x square plus x square 1 by x square plus 1 where x is less than 0 where we need, we need to find the range of k here okay so let's try this question guys so k is equal to x4 plus 1 by x4 plus 1 where x is less than 0 and what do we need to find the range of k here so now let's solve it guys okay so obviously we'll just try to factorize uh, or simplify a bit actually okay so let's see what we can simplify here i'll write x8 plus x4 i think right plus 1 upon i can write here x4 plus x square plus 1 and this will be like uh, it will be x square upon x raised to 4 correct so x square upon x raised to 4 right now if you further simplify it so basically see what is what i'm trying to do actually uh, i will try to just uh, get this numerator in a form here get this numerator in a form here such that this uh, denominator and some part of numerator gets cancelled okay so i can further factorize it right because it is quite higher power and to get the value of range range of k in the higher powers could be a difficult task right just try to simplify the powers actually okay so to factorize it further what i can actually do is i need to do something in x raised to 4 form okay so what i'll do uh, basically i can see that I, it can get it can come to ultimately this form right for example x raised to 4 is square plus or minus twice x raised to 4 plus 1 so a square plus 2ab kind of form right so basically if what i'll do here i'll just write i'll just add x4 and subtract s4 x4 so in this in this basically once i add x4 okay x8 plus uh, it becomes twice x4 x raised to 4 plus 1 and minus x raised to 4 divided by x4 plus x square plus 1 okay so here in numerator i can basically write this as x4 is square plus 2x4 plus 1 right so what i can write here i can write this as x4 plus 1 whole square so i can write this as x4 x raised to 4 plus 1 whole square okay so let's write this guys so once i write this in the form of what x raised to 4 plus 1 whole square minus x raised to 4 divided by okay divided by x raised to 4 plus x square plus 1 now i can get this actually this is x x4 right so i can get this in the form of what i can just get this in the form of a square minus b square also so for that I basically need to change that x square x raised to 4 as x square again whole square like that okay so once I do this guys so what it actually becomes now it becomes x now a square minus b square is what a plus b into a minus b so I can write in the form of what x4 plus x square oh uh, sorry x4 plus 1 minus x square okay so x4 plus x square plus 1 into x4 uh, minus x square plus 1 divided by x4 plus uh, x square plus 1 okay and of course this into 1 by x square will come here this part right so of course into 1 by x square here okay now this part actually gets cancelled here so what I am getting here now so if you see here guys you will get that x square minus 1 plus 1 by x square okay and that actually becomes you can write this as you can and you know that you have to find the range of k right so try to get in the form of x plus 1 by x right so if you try to get in the form of x plus 1 by x i can quickly write this as x plus 1 by x whole is square minus 1 minus 2 that basically becomes x plus 1 by x whole is square minus 3 okay so basically this my whole expression changes changes to x plus 1 by x whole is square minus 3 correct so i hope you clear this step no x plus 1 by x, x square plus 1 by x square is equal to x plus 1 by x whole square minus 2 okay so this becomes minus 3 right so basically i know what okay so once you look at this expression guys x plus 1 by x whole square so obviously for this x plus 1 by x its maximum value will tend to plus infinity right because i can have any negative value of x there's no range x is negative right i can put any negative value Anna? and it can go to ne that negative square will become positive so it can go to plus infinity right that minimum value so i know that x plus 1 by x its minimum value occurs at when at what value occurs at what value at x equal to minus 1 occurs at uh, what value x equal to minus 1 right that means at x equal to minus 1 
which becomes minus one plus one by minus one whole square minus three that is minus one and minus one two or uh, square four minus three is one right basically its minimum its minimum value is one okay and its maximum value is plus infinity right so that's why the range here includes to the range here k belongs to what one to infinity this should be the answer okay so basically the minimum value is minus one here right and we know that x plus one by x uh, it's it is always either for positive value it is either greater than equal to two or for all negative value it is always less than equal to minus two okay and also also this combat guys okay so this uh, combat uh, uh, you know it's a very good test series it contains some good high quality questions okay so their easy questions are, are not asked here so it basically it contains only good uh, medium and high quality questions with some uh, very advanced concepts okay and uh, uh, this from this sunday onwards it is in basically revised format so basically we are mo moving closer to cat right now so in january february and march we were like away uh, we are around eight to ten months away from cat so the questions we put off maybe some uh, easier or medium level right but this from now onwards the questions will be of higher higher level okay and uh, all the lrda sets also um, this quant questions also and basically it's a fun it's fun right actually giving this is a fun because after every question you get to get, get to get your live ranking okay then uh, after every question the faster you answer the better your the better your rank is right you get more points so actually those one hour test is a fun and actually if you look at the cat you should give uh, multiple uh, sectional tests and tests before cat okay and this is one of your high quality tests absolutely free of cost and uh, now from uh, earlier it was not that rewarding but now they have introduced some uh, great rewards in this i think okay so rank one to three one year subscription i think around twenty thousand or seventy five percent scholarship or fifty percent so, so, so great prizes are on offer here okay so get it live from your mobile app you just put the in, uh, link here i'll uh, this uh, invite code you can put here ravi roda it ask you for invite code it is absolutely absolutely free of cost okay ask you for invite code put ravi roda and the link i'll put in description just enroll from there okay and do give this every sunday do give this at 12 pm it's on every sunday okay so every sunday give this on 12 pm thank you